encourage you, keep the legacy burning bright. Next generation, keep it burning bright. Make a difference. Don't be the status quo. Just don't be like anybody else, but make a difference. Your name may not be Cesar Chavez, and it may be some other name. But listen, you can make I mean, a difference. Si se puede. A lot of us are here because we wanted to be here for this event, but we are also here in honor of other people, representing other people that are no longer with us. have Avenida Cesar Chavez uh, being installed in the background over here. Uh -huh. What does this mean for the community to have a street name after Cesar Chavez? Well, it's a, a representation of all of the aspirations of not only Hispanics, but all people. Hollister being part of that movement, it's, it really is an important sign historically that finally we recognize how great this person was for our community. You know, I'm really thankful and really proud that Hollister San Benito County is acknowledging Cesar Chavez. It's quite an honor, for, not only for us, but for the community at large and the legacy that Cesar has, has in this community. Long, long overdue. We are also here in honor of other people, representing other people that are no longer with us. I resonate so much with what Mike Sanchez is saying. In the summer of 81, my grandfather was arrested in San Benito County alongside Cesar Chavez, his son, and others. My grandma, mom, aunts, uncles have a history here for standing up for what's right. There are many untold stories like mine in our community. And events like the renaming of Union Road to Avenida Cesar Chavez gives hope to a future generation. My grandparents never got to see this moment, but I have an inkling that they're smiling down as the light continues to burn bright. Yeah.